Welcome to the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp. I'm Levi Flores, and we have some D-League action, the boys' middle school. It's the Dazzle versus the Rim Rockers. Court number one, the second game of the day here on court one. Rim Rockers coached by Landis Spivey, and the Dazzle coached by Denny I. All the campers just had their dinner break, so they should be well energized. We'll see how they do. 15-footer straight down the hatch. Dylan Bader gets the first points on the board for the Rim Rockers. Rim Rockers in white and Dazzle in orange. Carter Rhodes controlling from the corner over the top. Nico Taro wide open, got it to drop. Defense got caught lacking on that one. Dazzle ties it up, 2-2. The Rim Rockers back with the ball. Head coach Landis Spivey, a former junior college player out of Columbia, now D1 player. And for Dazzle, who get the ball back after the turnover, head coach Denny I, CCC MBCA Hall of Fame coach Denny I. It's the California Community College Men's Basketball Coaching Association Hall of Fame. As... He has Nico Taro down low getting two baskets to start it off. One of the smaller players still getting points over the big men down low. Lemon floats up and Rhodes gets a hand in there. Sneaks it in. Quick pass, Lepore. Splits the defense, got it to go. Rhodes on Lemon. Tried driving in, lost the ball. Lemon the other way, Rhodes catches behind him. And the scoop layup down the hatch. Middle school teams yesterday still getting their bearing straight, and today looking very good after having a few coaching sessions and having their team practices for the first time this morning. Coach Landis Spivey wanting both teams to play at his pace. D1 players, of course, pushing that ball all the time, moving quickly down the court, getting quick shots. Fortunately, unfortunately there, Lemon. Couldn't get that three. Rhodes hesitates. Over Lepore, mid-range goes down. Bader on the move, right hand, won't go. Jackson Franson picks it up, leading down the middle of the court. Two steps, got rid of it in time, off the hands of the defense, back into the hands of Franson. Bader, top of the arc, wide open triple, yes! Knocks it through. Bader gets the rebound. Try to force the fast break. Bader Euros around, swatted out, and still gets the points. Bounce pass to Franson, one-on-one -on -one against Lepore. Caught in the paint, needs to get rid of it. Tosses up, Lepore gets a tip. Hits the support system, and it's going to stay right here. Bounce pass to Nico Taro. One dribble, picked it up, back out. 
Mid-range looks good, comes off way short, allow it to go out of bounds. That leads us to our first timeout, 11-6, the Rim Rockers dazzling the dazzle. Rimrockers 11, Dazzle 6. It's the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp, the D-League Division, which is the Boys Middle School. And head coach Landis Spivey of the Rimrockers starting this game off hot. Current D1 college player at Central Washington making a statement at the camp. Is here a steal for Rhodes. A good move at the basket, swatted at by Bader. Unfortunately, the ball just didn't get the English off of it. Lemon, three ball, no. Dazzle kind of taking a play out of the Rim Rockers playbook. Moving that ball quickly after the rebound. No full court press until the final two minutes in the second half. So as soon as you get that ball, the, no the defense can't poke it out. Here's a steal for Lepore, two on one. Lepore, an easy right-handed flick. Franson stripped by Lepore. Up the court to Lemon, two on one. Nico Taro trying to make the stop and Lemon won't go. Second chance underneath, ball rattles off. Third time's the charm, rolls through. Nico Taro, three ball. Lemon, top of the arc. Yes! Dannon Lemon knocks down the three ball. Defense nowhere near. Rim Rockers now lead 18 to 6. Lemon back on the move. Favoring the right sideline. Franson on the defense. Now slowing up. Cross court left side. Lemon wide open from the corner. Rhodes comes on the defense, catches off guard, blocked from behind. Three ball, corner. Lapore, one on one. Bader looks for a three himself. I'll be last touched by the Rim Rockers, so they put it right into the hands of Dazzle. They could have got the rebound. <clears throat> Poor, great defense. Making the stop on France and he'll get the ball in hand. <coughs> Body bump there on France and Lepore and the Rim Rockers get the ball. <laughs> 
Rhodes making the move. Laporte came over to help. Left hand finish won't go. Rhodes a little frustrated with himself, missing a few baskets at the rack, but the defense had a huge part in those misses. Three ball, Bader. That'll be off the foot of Judah Schaefer, so the ball will stay there with the Rim Rockers. Bader, another three, second time in a row. Won't get that one either. Landis Spivey still loving that three ball. Wants them to keep shooting. Osborne helping on the defense. And go back and find his man, which is Nico Taro. One on one. Lemon picks up the foul. And Rhodes having to earn his points one by one from the free throw line. And that'll send us to the next timeout with the air horn blowing 27. It's a 13 point game. How was camp for you, Blake? It was really fun. Yeah? What was your favorite part of NorCal Sports TV's summer basketball camp? The atmosphere. Just being out here, feeling close to nature. Like, I woke up in the morning from getting my award uh, for the 6 a.m. practices. I woke up in the morning, I saw three deer just pass by. I got a video. It was really cool. And I love the atmosphere. I love the coaches. I love everybody here. Everybody's here to get better. Everybody's here to have fun. And, you know, I like the competitiveness as well, so... It's the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp. Rim Rockers lead 18-6 over Team Dazzle. Great effort so far by both teams. Dazzle lacking just a little bit on the offensive side of the ball, not favoring them as much as it has the Rim Rockers. But Rhodes currently at the free throw line, looking to tack on an extra two points. The lid on the basket, we'll see if it's still there. And it continues to stay. Lid needs to be flapped up for the Dazzle. Second one goes through. One of two at the free throw line for Rhodes. Lemon to the corner. Coach Spivey wants him to shoot. Pass will be deflected. Taken away by Rhodes. Lemon quick on the defense. Bounce pass, pass Lepore. Shot won't go either. Silva back the other way. Driving inside, right handed finish, rattles through. Franson's pass taken away. Here's a fast pace once again from Spivey and the Rim Rockers. Silva looks for three. Shot goes short. Bad pass there, just outside. Spivey gonna put his offense into five out. Leave the paint open. Try to find an open man, there he is. Lemon was wide open inside. Lemon looks for three. Way too much on it. He's hit one three already. Caddy cutting down. Franson, three ball short. Rim Rocker staying with that 5 0 offense. 
And there is the travel on Caddy. Walked on the pass, gives it up. Bounce pass into the paint, a great find in the defense, tying it up for the jump. Lemon, great use of the handle. Ogburn up top, giving it up. Lapore. Lemon tied up with Caddy. Another great stop. He has the ball in hand. No full court press till mid court. Caddy have to try to find his way around Lapore. Gets a pass underneath, blocked from behind, but also a foul. So two shots for Schaefer. of two from the free throw line. That second one rattled in and out. Lapore back with it. On the move. Blocked from behind. Kept alive. Lemon triple. No. Rhodes up court. Here's Schaefer. Trying to give it up. Find another open shot. Results in a turnover instead. Lapore against Rhodes. Hard off the backboard. Drops it through. Push from behind on Nick Lapore. <laughs> and that is going to do it for the first half. 22 to 7, the Rim Rockers lead Dazzle in this D League Division game.
22 to 7, the Rim Rockers leading Dazzle at the half. You're watching the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp D League Division Action, the Boys Middle School Division. Rim Rockers head coach Landis Spivey been very vocal in the first half, and it's worked out for him with this huge lead that he has already. We'll hope that he can have the same reflection through the second half and keep that lead. Rhodes looks for a three ball, no. Pass over the top, Osberg got the defense to jump. Excuse me, that's Ogburn. Had the defense flying right by with the pump fake. Back into Ogburn. Franson on the D, Lapore up top. Wild pass barely kept alive by Lapore. 15 footer, no. Gets his own rebound underneath, one on one, caddy the block. A great stop by caddy jumping up and a little bit of smack talk saying get that out of here. Lapore against Caddy again, sizing him up. Not going to take the one-on-one. -on -one. Lapore sets the screen. Pick and roll. Double team. Puts it up. No. Another offensive rebound thanks to Ogburn. Nico Terrell will finally take it. Ogburn trying to get back on the defense. Stolen away. Here goes Bader. One-on-one -on -one against Rhodes. Little shoulder bump. And no whistle. Rhodes leading up to Caddy, and Caddy got it high up and in. Three ball, Bader, yes! Rattles it through. Rhodes just out of his hands before the travel. Still results in a turnover, Lapore. Coach Spivey wants Lapore to score. Going to give it to Bader instead. Roll the pick and roll. Teardrop over Franson. Won't go. It's going to stay right here with the Rim Rockers. Lapore, top of the arc, flings it to the corner, baseline, yes! From 10 feet out, got it to drop through, that's Tony Silva. Rhodes over the top, led the pass a little bit too soon. Rhodes gonna hit the free throw line now. His Bader will come back to the sideline, get a little sip of water. Rhodes hits two of two from the free throw line. Dazzle looking to come back from the deficit. Thank you. 
Got a travel call on Nico Taro. Lapore against Franson. Left a wide open man on the baseline again. Shot won't go this time. Good ball movement so far by Dazzle. Franson spin, shot won't go. And then Dylan Bader brings it down. Lapore, one on two against Franson. Euros around, goes up with the right hand. Gets a second chance and puts that one through. First one poked out by Franson. Lucky for Lapore to follow a shot. Bader gets the rebound, and I believe Lemon's going to come in for him, so he might as well take advantage of the possession while he has it. Silva dribbles it out of the paint. And that'll lead us to our timeout. 29-11, the Rimrocker is still on top of Team Dazzle. How was camp for you, Blake? It was really fun. Yeah? What was your favorite part of NorCal Sports TV's summer basketball camp? The atmosphere. Just being out here, feeling close to nature. Like, I woke up in the morning from getting my award uh, for the 6 a.m. practices. I woke up in the morning, I saw three deer just pass by. I got a video. It was really cool. And I love the atmosphere. I love the coaches. I love everybody here. Everybody's here to get better. Everybody's here to have fun. And, you know, I like the competitiveness as well, so... Ten minutes left to play. The Rim Rockers 29, Dazzle 11. Last night the coaches got together, drafted their teams, and this is where we land. And right now the teams are still trying to get together, get themselves together, their offense, their defense, work together as a team. And so far, Landis Spivey between these two teams looks to be the better half and the better coach. But you never have to underestimate Coach Denny I. He will show up this week. You don't know when, but it'll happen. And most likely on Championship Friday when the games matter most. Unfortunately, the offense still not working for Team Dazzle, but an old-timer like Denny I, you know that what they say, duct tape can fix anything, and that's what needs to happen for the offense. Deep mid-range ball comes up short. Rhodes up court. Oh, unfortunate, the shot still missing. Getting great plays on the court. Just the ball doesn't have the height to get up and through. <laughs> Lemon makes the move, picks up the ball, and there is the foul on Rhodes. Dayton Lemon to the free throw line. Coach Spivey wanting foul calls throughout the entire game has only gotten a few of them. I don't think the referees are hearing him too much. Lapore, the offensive rebound. Put back, good. Great backdoor pass, yes! 
Dazzle answer back on the move from the baseline. Lapore caught in the middle. He'll draw the foul. Lepore misses again, picked up by Team Dazzle, and it's their ball when we come back. 31-13, the Rimrockers lead at the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp. The NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp D-League Division. The Rim Rockers and Dazzle 31-13 with seven to play. Landis Spivey and the Rim Rockers leading this one the entire time. Look to close it out here. It'll be Dazzle ball. No full court press until the final two minutes of this second half and Rim Rockers are trying to play defense on the wrong basket. Schaefer, nice move around, a little help from the offense down low. Judah Schaefer adds another deuce, 31-15. Schaefer back with the scoop. Lemon the rebound, one on three, fast break. Scoops it up, hits the bottom of the backboard. That'll stay here with the Rim Rockers. Spivey calling out the play. Wide open man underneath. The basket goes. Carrillo right underneath. Yes. It took a minute for Dazzle get into the game, but the second half... It's doing well for them. Bader picked up the dribble. Franson pushing him back. Looks like he got away with the travel there. Lemon, three ball, no. Willis, 17 feet out, blocked by Korea right. That'll lead Nico Taro down the court for Dazzle. Cross court, Schaefer won't go. Willis, pump fake, back out to Bader. Uses the screen, Willis, three ball, no.
Caddy won't get the floater. Lemon looks for three, comes up short again. Nico Taro rolling down another rebound. Nico Taro floats it up. A bad pass by Bader. Hits Carrillo right in the shoulder. What a squid of a pass. Bader keeping his dribble, splits the defense. Franson throws down an arm, but the basket won't go for Bader. Silva, baseline. Nico Taro rebound for the lead. Dazzle back down the court, 35-15, a 20-point difference with three to play. Lemon gets the steal. Lemon going to step out of bounds, be the last to touch it, and turn it over. Good put back by Judah Schaefer underneath. Slowly bringing this game into a possible reach. Lemon, three ball, no. Here goes Schaefer again. Hands it over to Caddy. Caddy looks for three. A few missed chances there by Dazzle, but they brought it close 33-19. With two minutes to play, it's the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp. How was camp for you, Blake? It was really fun. Yeah. What was your favorite part of NorCal Sports TV's Summer Basketball Camp? The atmosphere. Just being out here, feeling close to nature. Like, I woke up in the morning, from getting my award uh, for the 6 a.m. practices, I woke up in the morning, I saw three deer just pass by. I got a video, it was really cool. And I love the atmosphere, I love the coaches, I love everybody here, everybody's here to get better, everybody's here to have fun, and you know, I like the competitiveness as well, so. Final two minutes of the game, D-League action. Rockers and Dazzle. Rim Rockers have led the entire time, but Dazzle, 35 to 19, they've brought it close. Bader looks for three. Dazzle has two minutes. Try to make the comeback. Still down by quite a bit, but Franson, if he can do that every time, it'll be a close one soon enough. 33-21. Lemon, great find underneath. Another offensive rebound, turnaround jumper, yes! No use of the backboard, just dropped straight through and Coach Spivey wants the end one. Referees, no comment still. Wrong source of communication for Spivey, maybe he should try to use the landline. Lapore with the steal. Mike in the hands of the defense, poking it out like a pine needle. Lemon, great find, Lapore, yes! Rim Rockers right back in it. Saying, you thought you had a chance, no you don't. There's only 40 seconds on the clock, and just like that, 37-21 with four straight points.
And it looks like the Rim Rockers are just going to dribble it out. Going to hold it there. Take the victory. 37-21. This Dealey game comes to an end. And Landis Spivey pick up another victory. And Coach Denny I will take a loss. 37-21, the final score. It's the NorCal Sports TV Summer Basketball Camp.